the police constable killed and the Westminster terror attack while guarding the Houses of Parliament will be honoured with a full police funeral today. Thousands of officers from right across the country are expected to line the streets in tribute to PC Keith Palmer. The Queen gave special permission for his coffin to rest in the Houses of Parliament overnight, an honour usually reserved for heads of state. Our chief correspondent Richard Gaysford joins us now and Richard is near Southwark Cathedral. That's where the service is going to be held and there has been a guard of honour. It's, it, it's very emotional, very emotive as well, this guard of honour and a guard of honour through the night, Richard. That's right, it's Keith Palmer's former colleagues who've been watching over his coffin overnight. They serve with the Parliamentary and Diplomatic Protection Command and they will they be the ones who eventually watch his coffin go from Westminster along the streets through London here to Southwark. Now these roads where this protest, uh, procession will come are, are currently closed. It's a really tight security operation here this morning. You can see the crowd control barriers are out. They're expecting 50,000 people to come to line the streets to pay their last respects. The speakers are there so that they can hear what's being said in the cathedral, which lies just behind these buildings. And it's going to be one of the biggest ever gatherings of police officers too, we understand, Eamon. Uh, the Police Federation expecting up to 5,000 officers to come from all over the country. And we're hearing this morning that train companies are offering them free travel. They're going to get free travel on the buses and tubes here in London as well. So they can come and pay their last respects to a fallen hero.